So this is the wonderful Alessandro's studio. He's a professor at Urbino State University. Well, I'm sorry, just Urbino University is hosting me. That was my bed. It folds out nicely and very practical. and Made me very happy as former worker at Hellenic Futon. All kinds of little great keepsakes. And look at this view of the window. That's my bedroom view. So cool. Each window has a slightly different view, of course. Let's see up into the hill sign, which I'm planning to walk momentarily after my cappuccino. I love this table. It's not only a ping pong table, but it's also a nice solid work table. So all little out of the way stools, which is cool. A great electric piano, which I've been playing each morning. Oh, I miss playing so much. If only I was any good. Really cool storage over there. Little standalone center vanity. And I love this bathroom. Tiled floor. Really cool shower. Look at that. Like being in the rain, singing in the rain. And this really cool spout, of course, for getting to those hard to reach places. And look at the view out the shower window. Look at this. Un. Believable, right? So cool. This is why I'm coming back to Urbino as soon as possible. Well, let's keep going. So it's time for cappuccino. Sorry, you might want to block your eyes during this jiggly part. Up the stairs. Out the ancient door. And look at this. Hear Italian in the distance, the plaza. And right there, the casa, all the way up. There's the iconic, one of the casa corner towers. Can you see it if I just, there we go. Very cool. Over there, incredible views, but we're not going this way. We're going this way because I need my cappuccino. <laughs> now, it may be a Renaissance city, but they're not without some modern conveniences. Fun. Cool restaurant. I might have lunch there today. We'll see. Looks like they have great stuff. Very affordable. I'd say meals are a third of the price here versus New York, Boston. That's where I got my really cool new sweatshirt for just 10 euros. In fact, nope, mine is cooler than those. I'm not buying or sending postcards, but there they are. Buongiorno. Ah, si, si, si. Ah, si, si, si. Ah, I don't know what he was saying, so maybe me saying yes, yes, yes was not such a good thing. But here we have the the center, this incredible fountain, I'll just do an around, a nice little bus to get here. Now through that door there, right there, is the university where I taught two days ago and where my good friend Alessandro is a professor and runs the computer science department. Very cool. In the cafe where I'm about to get my cappuccino. They also have wine. I think they're open 24 hours. They've never been closed. Just going around 
Piazza della Repubblica. Very cool. Farmacia. Gelateria. Pizzeria. Buco. Very cool. But what I most love about Urbino is the contrast. So you have this incredible architecture, you know, five, six hundred years old. And then you get this. Deadpool. <laughs> All side by side. Super cool. And of course, it's the cafe culture that I most love. Well, it's hard to say what I most love. I love it all. But you have cafe after cafe after cafe. This is four different cafes. Grazie. And then, of course, the incredible selection. Oh, fresh baked. That was my dinner a few nights ago. That would be just an appetizer in Italy. And the incredible...